Damn, man. Is this the place? It wasn't supposed to go down so. like this. Uh, Let me handle this. Just wanted to see Andrea. You wait out here, okay? My weak will. And why would I do that? No, I'm coming with. I'm not really sure that... You're a man of many talents, but talking isn't one of them. Good evening. Oh. Hey, uh. Welcome to the heart and soul of Wall Market, the Honey Bee Inn. Is there a honey boy or girl whose company you desire? Uh, we're here to see Andrea Rodea. Ah, the shining star of the Honey Bee Inn. Now, are you the one who made the appointment, sir? Can I have your name? Oh. We don't have an appointment. I see. I'm terribly sorry, sir. An appointment is required. And the earliest available slot is three years from now. Three years?! All we want is five minutes. He can spare that. I need his help for the Corneo audition. Yes. Well, regardless of the circumstances, you cannot meet him without an appointment. Is there really no other way? It is rare. But Mr. Rodea does occasionally extend invitations who catch his eye. Otherwise, I'm sorry, but there really is nothing that can be done. I guess that's that then. Oh well, let's try someone else. I know why you're here. Oh, oh gosh. Come on, old man. Uh, aren't you that leaf house? Uh, hey! What the hell, Merc? Digging into people's personal affairs in this town is a huge no-no. What are you doing here? Uh, well, if you must know, I've wanted to be a dancer ever since I was a little girl. I come here at night to live the dream. Uh, I'd appreciate it if you didn't tell the children, okay? I've always wanted to dance for a living. Gotta stay sharp, though. Lifetime bands a lifetime band. Oh, that's right. As if you're not here to talk with the honey boy. I'm sorry that I couldn't be of more help to you. Andrea shows transcend beauty in the chamber. You feel wow. This is it. Oh. the two of you step right up now then what manner of massage do you desire say what is this your first time in our establishment mm -hmm. we are a hand massage parlor an excess of fatigue and tension can make even the simplest task a terrible strain it is our pleasure to relieve our patrons of that tension <laughs> And what better way to seek relief than through the skilled ministrations of a professional? So now that we understand each other, what manner of massage do you desire? We're not customers. And you are? Hoping you can help us get an invite to an audition with oh, Don for love of Say another word and I'll shove this fan right down your throat. Oh. Uh, 
Ugh, this is the last thing I need. You're young and stupid, and I suppose that means you think I'll let you off easy. So, you want what? A favor? Well, here's the thing. This is a massage parlor, a respectable establishment. But if you don't require our services... Then tell me! Is there any reason I shouldn't have you dragged outside and shot for wasting my valuable time? Well... Hmm... Name? Cloud Strife. Hand. Huh? Give it to me! The strong, firm hands of a fighter, yet they possess a certain elegance and grace. Okay, Cloud. Let's see what you're made of. After that, we'll talk. So, which course will it be? <laughs> then make your way to the room in the back and wait. Cloud? Well then, it should go without saying that you get what you pay for. All four fingers at once, quick and to the point. <clears throat> Little rough. Hmm? They can stop at any time if it's too much to handle. <laughs> Try flexing the muscles. You'll feel the difference. Loose and limber. Am I right? Actually, yeah. Mm. How was it? It's all right, I guess. What are you doing? Flexing. Flexing. Uh, never mind. Hm. Think you'll make a habit of it? <sighs> All right then. I think I've seen everything I need to see. So, tell me what you want, and we'll take it from there. Sure you're okay? Yeah. You're one of the trio, right? I want to get into Corneo's next audition. And why in the world would you want to do that? Hmm... Okay. Really? But you cannot go dress like that. Huh? I could never send Corneo a candidate wearing such a plain-looking getup. Doing so would call my position as one of the trio into question. Is something wrong with my outfit? matter what I think? Well, I think it's pretty cool. Look, just take it outside the parlor, would you? Sorry, we'll stop. So, what should I do about the outfit? Hmm. <laughs> you just leave that to me. I'll put you in a dress so fabulous, you'll look like a million gill. So long as you can afford it. 
How much? What I said. But don't worry. It's obvious you can't afford a dress with that kind of price tag. So listen, I have an idea. Uh. There's an underground coliseum in this town. Up for a fight, Cloud? Good. Because I'm getting you into that arena. If you win the tournament, I'll transform Aerith into a drop-dead gorgeous beauty. Is there any prize money? <laughs> yes, for the person who got you in. So, what do you say? All right. That's what I like to hear. You'll need this. They're already letting fighters inside. You should hurry. Run along. into nothing good I wouldn't expect a fair fight in this town think we can win it all that's one thing I'm definitely sure of I appreciate the confidence right just don't right get too yeah. cocky okay the doors are now open for tonight's Corneo Cup What's this? You're here to compete? <laughs> I hope you know you're cutting it really close. So, the two of you are a team? Team? No, it's just me. Yes, the two of us are a team. I need to get into that audition, but I won't let anyone else fight my battles for me. That includes you, mister. All right, team it is. Head to the waiting area down below. This is gonna be so much fun. You lost? This is for spectators only. does this thing go, you think? I wonder how many people are fighting. Hey, you're not nervous, are you? Nope. Really? You're even more quiet than usual. Just trying to focus, like you should. Just needed a little scratch, you know. So I signed up for the preliminaries, and well, I hope you guys realize I don't want to scare you, but if you can make a run for it, you should. 
Cloud and Aerith, your match will begin shortly. Please make your way to the gate. We're in way too deep to back out now. It's a gift from Don Corneo. Drink it, and they say you'll be raring to go for hours on end. If I had, maybe things would have gone differently for me. Maybe you should. It's yours if you want. You two ready? Try not to get yourselves killed. For our next match, we welcome two fighters, a young couple no less. Talk about a bad day! And this is their first tournament, the bad first date! And most likely their last, inexperienced as they are. Or are they? Give it up for Cloud and Eric! Go home, you suck! <laughs> Couple, get out of here with that lovey dummy bullshit! What's up with the pole? Gonna do a little dance for us, baby girl? <laughs> okay, now I'm mad. What if Walmart gets owned? A renowned master of beasts! Will his pets make a meal of our two challengers? The far very eyes! They've already been given their appetizers! Their hunger for flat pet fear is unquenchable! The demon dogs of hell! The Sanguine Stalkers! <laughs> You brought animals? Oh, first timers, huh? There's no rule that says you gotta fight man to man. We're in for a treat, ladies and gentlemen. Who will prevail in this brutal contest between man and beast? This could be over in an instant, so don't even blink. Without further ado, the fourth match of the first round begins now! Cut! Shoot! Contenders, please return to your waiting room. Well, that's one win down. Go team! Hmm. What's wrong? The rules don't make sense. Yeah, true. But maybe it'll be better in the next match? Nah, wouldn't bet on it. Better to expect the worst. That was some bullshit. Guess I'd better start looking for a new job.
That's what they call beginner's luck. But the next match won't be so easy. Ready to rock? Just remember, try not to die. For the second match in our spectacular semifinal, fresh from their first date with death, I present the Lucky Couple! We're like unlucky for the rest of us! Give it up once again for Cloud and Eric! Criminal for common criminals, the worst of the worst! Ladies and gentlemen, check their pockets, because they may have already robbed your blind! The most contemptible sons of bitches in town of war market, Bex did give him a massage, you know. His palm told quite the tale. He's cheated death more than a few times. <laughs> so have half the people in this town. Anyway, we're both still alive. Call it. <sighs> there you go again. One of these days, your luck is going... When I fall for grace, maybe I'll land in your parlor. That is one mistake I will never repeat. 
You gotta admit, Andy, the way he moves is totally amazing. Andy! <sighs> Next up, the big finale. Yeah. I thought you'd be happier. Just thinking about what we might face next. But you know, we've made it this far. I'm sure we can handle anything they throw at us. Cloud and Aerith. The final match will begin shortly. Please make your way to the gate. Man, you proved me wrong. You guys are pretty good. It's the final match. You good to go? I've got a lot of money riding on you two. Win it for me! Ladies and gentlemen! Our time together is almost over! Tonight's thrilling Corneo Cup, filled with unprecedented upsets and drama, has only one match to go! <laughs> we know! We're just as disappointed as you are! But ladies and gentlemen, all good things must come to an end! So let's celebrate by getting so damn loud, they'll hear us up on the play! Yeah! Come on! Once more, the sweethearts who surprise us with upset after spectacular upset. The power couple with the boundless love for bloodshed. The champions of Madame M, Cloud, and Eric! Executioners, Chocobo Sam's champions, Cuddy and Sleepy! Come on now! Robots? More like Shinra armor. Waiting. Who will walk away with the one million bill prize? Get ready for a fight guaranteed to go down in history! The final match of the Corneo Cup begins now! Taking this rather well. I was looking forward to a little temper tantrum. You bet it all on a toss. Sometimes, Lady Luck, every coin has two sides. You're right, of course, even if they are both the same. <laughs> Later. And now, I believe I have a prize to collect. Sorry. The madam will have to wait. 
The Don's demanding that we tack on one more match, it seems. What? If they win out, then you get paid in full. Now hold on just a goddamn minute! His call, not mine. <laughs> now that that's over, we can go save Tifa. So we'll head back to Madame M's, get you changed, and then it's off to Corneo's. Right. Sorry to be the bearer of bad news. But... you still have one fight left. What do you mean? The crowd loved your show a little too much. People were placing hefty bets, much heftier than you can possibly imagine. Corneo's going to milk this for as much as he can. Meaning what? You face and defeat Corneo's fighter of choice, and only then will you be declared winners of the tournament. Hey, that wasn't the deal! Don't you think I know that?! Ah! You greedy bastard! Scum-sucking piece of shit-festering asshole! Uh... <sighs> but that's the way it is. Corneo's the one who makes the rules around here. But if you win this, though, we'll have to accept your victory. And the crowd will make sure he does. So this is the last one? <laughs> I sure hope so. Go on now. That prize money is going to pay for your dress.